Now, four out of ten outside directors at Korea's top 30 conglomerates are former bureaucrats. Korean companies have shown a preference for hiring retired senior government officials for their influence as lobbyists to circumvent tight regulations. And this is in contrast to the U.S., which prefers outside directors with actual field experience. Kim Minji has more. It's been common practice in Korea for conglomerates to hire former bureaucrats as outside directors. According to Market Tracker CEO Score, among some 600 outside directors at 187 affiliates of the nation's top 30 groups, 39 percent were former government officials. Only 97 independent directors, or 16 percent, were from business circles. This is in sharp contrast to the top 100 firms selected by Forbes, which prefer to hire specialists in certain fields. Among 815 independent directors, almost three quarters were former businessmen, while ex bureaucrats accounted for less than 10 percent. Korean companies tend to show a strong preference for retired senior bureaucrats as outside directors because of their close ties with political circles or the government, which can help them exert influence. The U.S., on the other hand, prefers those with on-the-job experience. At U.S. retail giant Walmart, for example, five out of nine independent directors are from business circles, including the CEOs of Instagram and Yahoo. Korea's top conglomerate, Samsung Group, hired roughly a third of its outside directors who were former government officials, while the figure stood at about 7 percent for former businessmen. At five Korean conglomerates, including Tuzan Group and CJ Group, the proportion topped 60 percent. However, the ratio of outside directors from government circles in Korea is on the decline. The number of former bureaucrats fell 7 percent from 2013, reducing the overall proportion by almost 3 percent. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.